I'm so grounded. Sitting on the f***ing floor. Hi guys and welcome to Fry Diary. Fry Diary is the look back at my week and I haven't done it for the last two weeks because I was working on a project that I wasn't allowed to tell you about that I was filming some stuff for and now it's out in the open. If you guys haven't heard, Hannah Hart and I are shooting a series up here in Vancouver called Electro Woman and Dyna Girl, which was a 70s television show and now we are rebooting it for the digital space and we're becoming superheroes. And we just started actually filming three days ago but we have been in Vancouver for over two weeks doing pre-production and rehearsals and all that kinds of fun. Superheroes don't need to speak, right? It's all about action, not dialogue, right? Like a Michael Bay movie? I don't know, is that a reference? People say it, so I just repeat it. I think people think parrots are so smart, because they just repeat everything they hear. So make sure you go to electromandinagirl.com so you can sign up for information about the project and uh, updates that get emailed to you as we go along with this shooting process. Without further ado, here is a look back at the last couple weeks of getting started on the project. I made it to the airport with my best friend. Bloody Mary hey. and Manna. Hannah has told me that she has the greatest story to tell me about her trip to the airport, but she actually wanted to tell me on Fry Diary. So hold on a second so I can put the camera on her. I can't tell. I, okay. I can't even, I don't even know how to start telling you about this. So when I was driving over, uh -huh. my driver told me that the last person that was in his car was... Who? What? <laughs> Be honest. And me, I've lost all my friends. Hi, Fray Diary. It is the end of Wednesday, and Hannah and I just got back from an acting coach session because we start shooting in a week and a half. We're not the strongest actors in the world, but we're getting there. So we're working on some great stuff. The fun, oh, I don't know if I told you guys this. In fact, I know now that I definitely didn't tell you guys this. Um, so my foot is in an ace bandage. Look how great I am at wrapping. Yeah, so great at wrapping ace bandages, so. My foot is in an ace bandage because um, a few days ago, before we came up here to shoot, I went over to Hannah's place and um, instead of having her open her garage back door, I climbed up over it and jumped down and I was a little intoxicated. And the next morning I woke up and the top of my foot hurt so bad. So um, who knows what happened? I think I like sprained it or something, um, which will be really fun because tomorrow we start our stunt rehearsals. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, I'm just having dinner with a glamour eye. No big deal. And look what's happening. Oysters. The glamour eye is stunned. And then I feel like you can even you can do it as much as you go. Bang, bang, whack. So you yeah. can pull around the okay. side. So that's it. Yeah. <laughs> oh look, this lighting's perfect. Oh, you were so in the dark before. There it is. I'm always in the dark. It is Tuesday, which is the first day of our week, and Hannah's here, and we're going to do more stunt rehearsal. How are your shoulders? Ready for some shoulder rolls? Yeah. Yeah. Great content. <laughs> Hannah, I'm only filming your feet as to not give away your costume. Uh, are you very excited? At this point in time? I think no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're doing hair and makeup <laughs> testing. It's very exciting business. This is the happiest day of my life. Oh great. <laughs> the glamour eye is officially becoming a thing. They're trying to incorporate the glamour eye. Well, a person loves it and that person's hand of heart. <laughs> Back in the office that's today, and look what's here. Right. Right. Whoa. Oh my god, did you see this? What's that? Look at that, it's your little dude, except with a mask on, like a oh hero. Oh my god! I know, and look, it's got a belt on it. This oh, is this so is awesome. cool. It is officially day one on set, and I'm in my trailer. This thing was just here waiting for me. That's my welcome present. Shiva. <laughs> <laughs> We're actually on lunch. Hannah's been shooting some scenes so far. How have they gone? Really, really well. If you guys can tell, my hands are actually like a little bit bruised and stuff because the scenes I'm shooting, I'm like, oh, chained up. Yeah, I thought you were just saying, I'm, make, I'm flexing too hard. It's hurting. Oh, yeah, I flex so hard that I got a bruise. I think we have to flex our humility because they're really trying to give us egos. Look at this 
thing that was here. This well, that's our food. <laughs> and then they gave us this. What is that? What is that? It's so it's so beautiful. When I walked in this morning, I thought to myself, Oh wow, we're not sharing a trailer. And then I was like, Oh wow. 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 Really important business is happening. Character development story. Watch this. Matreya is becoming my makeup artist. It looks oh. great! Just wrapped on day one! Matreya's Woo! here, yeah! Matreya crushed and it, she did Hannah, so and look who showed up! <laughs> Goddamn Michael Goldfine sneaks on, gets a roll, nailing Canada. it. Good morning, it's day two, and we're going into set. Did I explain to you guys that we're shooting in an abandoned mental facility? Look at this. It's pretty terrifying. There's ghosts everywhere, apparently. Can't wait, let's do it. There's Hannah. She looks great. Look how not scary all of this is. That looks normal and safe. That looks normal and safe. Brett is terrifying. <laughs> current times, current times, current times, it's current times. There you go, there's a look back at the last few weeks of working on Electric Woman and Dino Girl. Get ready because we have two more weeks of shooting and you are coming with me, whether you want to or not. This is Take Your Subscribers to Work Day. I remember Take Your Daughter to Work Day was like a really fun thing because you got out of school and then when I actually went to my mom's work, I was like, oh, my mom works at a school. I did not think this through. I don't know. Literally the last person that was in his car was Beyonce and Jay-Z on their way to the Grammys. Yes! And I was like, where? He was like, I drove them. And I was like, oh. And I was like, in this car? And he's like, yep. And I was like, oh. And he just started licking the seat. I was like, which side did Beyonce sit on? He was like, that one. And I was like, oh. I mean, can you believe that? We're getting closer. First President Barack Obama. Then being in the same car. Yeah. I mean, that's a real. I don't know. I'm a good babysitter. Isn't that amazing? That's really great. Come on, that's amazing. It happened to you. <laughs> oh my god.